Hey, how's it going? In this shave, I am doing the side-by-side -side comparison that I still don't know how to pronounce her last name, uh, so you have to forgive my stupidity. Uh, Jill S. will say, she wanted to see Gillette Wilkinson Sword side-by-side -side comparison with a regular Wilkinson Sword. It has been forever, not forever, it's been a long time since I've used one of these. And I think I used it in my Wilkinson Sword Classic Razor, so I have no idea what it's actually like in my favorite razor, which is going to get the... Yeah, are you guys tired of seeing it? Hope not. But uh, in this shave, I promised my daughter, so I put her sign up that she made, see you in the next video, and I got the toilet paper. <laughs> this is going to stay. I might even sticky tack that up on the wall. I don't know. But anyway, I promised her how I would use this soap. She went through a couple of my soaps, and believe it or not, go figure, right? She liked Arco. She thought it smelled good. She liked the palm olive stick. Uh, she liked Mitchell's wool fat, and uh, she kind of quit smelling by then. Well, that is after she smelled this one. She wanted me to use it. It's the Vander Hagen Luxury. And um, if you have ever owned... Ralph Lauren Big Pony number two. It smells exactly like Ralph Lauren Big Pony number two. Uh, Samoog 1460. Um, yeah. This has been soaking for roughly 15 minutes. I have the body spray in the other room of the Ralph Lauren that I'm talking about. It's a body spray, so I'm not going to try to use that as an aftershave. I picked Fine American Blend, but for now I'm trying to get a lather going here. Yeah, this has been soaking for, like I said, 15 minutes. And this is a good soap. You can't mess this one up. If you're new to wet shaving, you cannot uh, mess this soap up. You can uh, not apply enough, and if you do that, you'll know. You'll know if you need more. And I don't think you can really... I really don't think you can over-apply. I don't have the box. But this is $5. Here in town, four like maybe four and change, five and change, something like that. <laughs> right on the back of the box, it says, "Works great as a uh, body bar in the shower." Well, at five dollars a bar, a uh, puck, I'm sure it does. Good grief! Now, this one of these is going in the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. As you see, I just keep keep going here. You can. You can't really overload it, I don't think. So, there is that. I'll set that down. And I haven't yet, but I'm going to go ahead and do a hot water routine now. So, I'll be right back. Okay, um, I had to go check. I lied. It's Big Pony number one. It's dead the same. Exactly the same. But, yeah, you cannot mess this soap up. Just load plenty on your brush and it'll do perfect for you. Even the uh, deluxe, the pink one, smells a little bit, uh, I don't know how you'd say that smells, kind of almondy but kind of not. I don't know how to describe that one. This is kind of sweet grapefruit orange, maybe. But out of the two smells, I would I would say I kind of like them both equally for what they are, and uh, we'll call that a lather and say it's ready. 
All right. So right side of the face, I'm going to go Wilkinson Sword Classic. On the left side, I already know what Gillette Wilkinson Sword is like. But uh, Jill said, pretty please. <laughs> please do a side-by-side. -side. So here's what the Wilkinson Sword Classic Blade looks like. And that'll go into the Merker Progress on setting three. Make sure I got it correct. There we are. Now on setting three. All right. Get the blade hot. I'll get the water hot. There we are. Here we go with the blade comparison. Uh, pass one uh, with the grain. I can't remember who, but somebody suggested that my angle is not correct, and that's why I'm chewing blades up. They said I'm too flat, I need to be more like this. It is still cutting. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that is very nice. If this wasn't a comparison, I would love to just do the rest of the shave with that blade. This is the other side. I did this one, now this one. I just now noticed there's a slight bit of overhang with this because it got my nose a little bit. I didn't. <laughs> I did not know that. How long have I been using this razor? I'm going to try to see, not try, I'm going to look and see who uh, wrote that comment. To hold my angle as much on the head as I can. That was very comfortable, very efficient, and uh, hopefully I don't chew through blades that way. By doing that, rather. Okay, here we go with the Gillette Wilkinson sword blade. Same setting, and I'm going to try the same angle after I do my sideburn. There we are. Okay, so... the same I think I don't know I know they're made in different areas I don't know where the Wilkinson sword classic is made but I know it's easily got at in England and I guess in Europe I don't know but the Gillette Wilkinson sword is Indian uh, for the Indian market And what I was getting at before, whoever made the comment is my angle was incorrect. I'm going to put their name down here so that you can see. I think they're on to something. And uh, hey, a year later, still learning. I, mean, I tell you, I wouldn't have it any other way. Who wants to... Who wants to know everything about something they like? Maybe somebody, maybe some people. I like learning new things. I really do. Oh, I like to read and learn. Forgot about this soap. If you've shaved an area and you try to go back over it with water, nothing left. All right, there we are. Okay, let me get some water on my face. We'll get into pants too. Okay, so when I added water right there, there was a slight bit of slickness. But honestly, this soap 
What I love about this soap is you can find it everywhere here in Cincinnati. You can. You can find it literally everywhere. Kroger, our grocery store, Walmart, any store that's um, like, a, like a, a pharmacy, Walgreens, which I think is this, they're in cahoots with Boots. I went to the Boots site to try to see if they could ship a Boots stick to the U.S. And it had a bunch of flags on the site. And before you even started ordering, it said ship to, and then it showed the flags, and I pressed USA. It took me to Walgreens. And then I searched on Google, and yes, they have partnered. But anyway, back to the where you can buy this soap. Walgreens, CVS, the drugstore here, pretty much. So this is the, I didn't change the blade. This is the Gillette Wilkinson Sword blade. I'm gonna keep it on three since we're trying this new angle thing. Um, here we go, cross grain. Oh, I didn't get the blade hot. And to me, I don't know, Gillette says uh, with their cartridge razors, if you rinse with hot water, it dulls the blades. Shaving with that angle is rather interesting. It's effective and wow, effective and comfortable. Have to tell myself not to push. Right. And I uh, might go for a third pass on this one. I might go baby bottom smooth. We'll see. I want to try baby bottom smooth with this new this new angle. So yeah, I'm not going by how I feel at the end of the shave. These blades feel pretty similar, and I imagine that they will shave pretty similar. Or as my dad would say, similar. <laughs> wow, that's nice. All right, well, let's go ahead and switch the blade. Okay, the blade is hot. This is the Wilkinson Sword Classic. Increased angle. Um, is that a little sharper? I don't know. It's it's comfortable though. That's all I can tell you. This is nice. Got myself there. I may have just got myself there. I do believe this is a little sharper. That and I was pushing a little bit because this new angle does 
take some uh, finesse. And I was not giving it finesse. Oh, that's a bump anyway. And I did get myself right where I thought. All right, well, I'm gonna get a rinse. I'm gonna get a rinse. I'm gonna do a third pass with just this blade. Okay, we need more. It's the thing, when it gets thin, you don't have to add any water. You just go back to the puck. There's water on your face. There you got it. This soap is perfect for me because it's idiot proof. Make mistakes on the channel all the time. Say things incorrectly and Long day at work. Brain still running at a million miles an hour. Okay, this one, if I need to turn it up, I will, but I've put it on setting two. So this is a Wilkinson Sword Classic Blade. Uh, pass three against the grain. So a little bit over there too. So with all of these nicks and cuts, you can know a few things. It's probably a sharper blade. I think it is. I wasn't being careful enough. And I was talking. Wow. Okay. You see my angle? Normally I would shave like that. I'm really, really angling it out to make that blade as flat as possible as the uh, commenter suggested. I do apologize. I can't remember the guy's name offhand. But uh, that was... That was a very good suggestion. And a very good observation on the other guys saying that uh, the ones who have the blades last the longest do this angle method. So, I'm sure somebody wanted to tell me that I wasn't doing it correctly, but just didn't. You can come straight at me and tell me things, guys. I'm not you're not gonna hurt my feelings. Alright, that's gonna need more soap. But I am gonna get baby bottom smooth. I yeah. Uh huh. Let's add some water to that, just to the tip there. Maybe wake that up a little bit. Do it again. Hot water. Brought it to life, huh? What I'm gonna look like when I'm 90 and I want a goatee that I don't know how to trim out properly. That right there. Santa Claus has a goatee. Old man, old man's eyes. Okay, here we go against the grain. Light touch. Oh, we got to do the Paul H. method, don't we? Okay, here we go.
Freaking genius. Works every time. I wonder if he learned that method anywhere. He just kind of thought it up. But somebody's got to think up the method first, don't they? You think about something long enough, you'll come up with a new way. Stretch it as much as possible. My skin here is really bumpy and the hairs grow out of bumps so I can't get too close or I'll, I'll bleed worse than that. So a little bit left right here and a little bit there and there and uh, we're on to the post. <laughs> Excuse me. Watch the progress handle. It's up that way that I need to go. So here we go. Sideways on the other side. Straight back on that right there. Straight back. Straight back. There we are. Huh? Sorry that's so unsightly, you guys. Everyone's overshaved a time or two, right? I've been that smooth since I was a baby. <laughs> All right. Let's get into the post and let's take care of that. <laughs> that was a lukewarm rinse. Okay, Witch Hazel from Sally Beauty, it's called Beyond Belief, nothing special about it, just some Witch Hazel. I'm going to try to make some of that, ooh, felt that, just a little bit, I'm going to try to make some of that uh, aftershave that uh, Stephen the Suffolk shaver made, I was talking to him on Facebook Messenger last night we were texting back and forth and uh, he was telling me what the proportions of the uh, ingredients were I didn't get to catch it I was watching the video but my daughter was uh, also watching YouTube a try not to laugh challenge hey daddy daddy watch this watch this so all right took the lid off Fine American blend. A nice, generous helping of that. And I know this is going to sting because I just went against the grain. Oh, oh, not too bad. Oh, that's nice. No more than I've had before on a two pack shave. It's about a Two out of ten on the burn scale. 
just got another little splash of it. I love this stuff. It smells so good. All right, to put the moisture back in, some CVS. I was talking about CVS earlier. A little bit of lotion. I got a little more this time because I am going to do that same thing I did last time. A little bit up here, a little there, a little here. A little like that. A little more even. Maybe you do need to do it like Paul. Boop, 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 right? And that's nice. Wow, that's smooth. Wow. That's a close shave right there. And I always have my styptic pencil ready to go. You just wet it down, wipe the blood away from a place, and give it a little bit of a zing. Oh, felt that one. Oh, oh, that's tender right there. Whew. Must be a good nerve ending there. <laughs> All right, down here I got a few. So what I'm gonna do? Get the entire general area there. Been a while since I went against the grain. Got more Knicks than New York over here, huh? All right. For those of you who may not have gotten that res uh, reference, restaurant, uh, New York Knicks is a basketball team. All right, well, I'd call that a successful shave. And I went a little longer because I added an extra pass, so we'll stay away from the porch tonight but uh, Jill if I'm not mistaken if memory serves me correctly you said you ordered 100 and you wanted to see a comparison uh, here's the answer to your comparison uh, I'm gonna take that a couple more shaves that Wilkinson sword blade take it the rest of the week uh, oh by the way thank you flash for sending that blade he gave me a tuck of that plus the Gillette Nasset or Nasset Nasset I don't know how you say that but anyway uh, thank you very much. But to answer your question, Jill, that was very nice. And I may order 100 of those uh, because I'm pretty sure they're reasonably priced. So I just may order 100. Anyway, uh, I hope this one found you with a good start to the week. And I hope you're having some good shaves. And... Uh, I hope you're not nicking yourself too much like I did. There's plenty of styptic pencil or styptic even liquid around, right? We've got the, what's the other one we have? I still got a weeper here, so let's try it. This is a crystal deodorant, which is alum block. Same thing. Put that all over your face, right? Little nick over there still. Let's try it. Wet it down. You wash it off later. It's supposed to help seal seal that stuff up. So I need to maybe start getting this out more often. I know, I've gone too long. I'm sorry. Anyway, I hope you're having a good start to your week. And uh, I hope you have some good shaves. And I don't know what I'm going to do for next shave. I don't even know if I'm going to do it Thursday. Because I just went against the grain. <laughs> I'll do it Thursday, but... It'll most likely be a two-pass shave. But let's make it the Wilkinson Sword Blade, shall we? All right, until then. That was loud, wasn't it? <laughs> until then, have some good shaves and take care.